Okay, so this is a quick video to explain how to send uh, the sound from VLC being screen shared inside OBS Ninja without getting weird echoes. So um, this is my uh, top left screen uh, that you are seeing right now. And I'm having uh, the view of the, um, of the screen sharing open. What I did it was create a room and then uh, join, uh, don't have anything as the director, and then join as a normal person with just a webcam, not screen sharing. And the settings on this is to use the default microphone and do the default uh, speaker out uh, for for uh, voice meter VAIO, not VAIO AUX, it's different. So VAIO is the main one. Um, and then what I did on the other tab that I use just for screen sharing is to have uh, the input as a voice meter aux output and uh, the output uh, doesn't really matter because I, I will be having it muted all the time anyways. Um, right now the video is uh, muted so so I can record this, but I will unmute it at some point to show you how it's working. So moving on to the um, bottom left screen, I have this, which is a VLC, and I can full screen it. And once I full screen it, if you go back to the screen, it's much cleaner. But uh, for now, I'm going to just not show this because I want to show you that the audio device is set to aux vio so the second one not vio which is the default but to the aux vio so that i don't listen it by default so moving on to my third screen we have this which is the well obs as you can see recording and uh, voice meter so voice meter right now is set to i'm not even capturing the the microphone through here uh, VAIO is just sending to the default output that I sent, which is the USB audio codec. And uh, the AUX VAIO is sending to B2, which should be itself, or uh, the virtual B2. The output of it. Um, so, uh, as far as I can understand this, the input that comes from VLC gets uh, rooted into the output of voice meter aux. Okay, so if we go back to, uh, actually I can switch to this screen. screen. So this, so this is, is the, um, the, the view, view inside, inside OBS, OBS Ninja. Ninja. And I had double sound there for a second. I'm gonna change the mutes. The mutes. Okay, now you hear me with uh, some auto gain and stuff from inside the, the thing, but you don't hear the sound of the video itself. If I go to the this tab, which you can't see on screen, but I can show you real quick. So if you go to this tab, that is just sharing the room. Uh, does it have a nickname defined, but uh, it might be easier to control things. Anyways, if I unmute this, you'll be listening to the audio from... Check it out. You can go, you back, go back to the video. Bye-bye, everyone. Take care. Okay, so now you're Hello, everyone. How are you doing? Welcome to another video log where I talk about the... And what's happening on the video. And this is all being recorded as it's being sent through OBS Ninja. Um, if I had more people talking in OBS Ninja, more guests, they would also be uh, being recorded here. And I think I would also be able to hear them because it's being default out to voice meter Avayu, which is rooted to the A2, which is my output. Stuff that I've been doing lately and uh, most have been working around. So yeah, this seems to work right now. Um, so I just have to figure out uh, these little details. 
I uh, hope this video re helps me remind how the hell to do these setups. Uh, it's a bit confusing for me. Anyways, hope this is useful for someone else um, or me, uh, the future me, in about a week or two when I have to set this up again. So, uh, yeah. Bye-bye, everyone. Take care.